Well, this is what happens whenever you're stupid and you get frustrated and you take it out on your tools that actually didn't do anything. Broke my hand plane. It, um, it already had a couple cracks right here at the mouth and that's actually exactly where it broke is on those cracks um, so still completely my fault um, should not have happened but I thought this would be a good opportunity to uh, see if I could fix it so if anybody else um, ever has a plane break on them like this then um, maybe they'll be able to fix this if my method works um, what I'm going to attempt to do is use some JB weld and just stick it back together. Uh, I've got it set on a piece of glass so that hopefully whenever I push it back together that makes sure that the sole is flat. Um, but uh, we're going to give this a go and see if it works. And uh, if it does, awesome. And I got my plane back and uh, might be able to help some other people if they ever have a plane that breaks. And if it doesn't work, looks like I'm going to have to buy a new hand plane. Um, I just got this one off of eBay. It was used, so it's not um, too terribly expensive, but it's still just really stupid on my part. Um, it shouldn't have happened. But might as well get some use out of it in this situation. So, here we go. Okay, here we go. JB Welders. That looks like a good amount. And of course it keeps coming out. I'm going to try not to overdo it with the JB Weld, but I want to make sure I get enough in there to do the job. I'm going to try to avoid getting it on the sole or putting too much down low on the sole as much as possible. I'm going to put some on both sides. Again, I've never done this before, so there might be some people out there yelling at me right now. But, uh, what the heck, man. It's already broken. You can't break it anymore, so might as well do a little test. Do a little test. Now we will stick her back together, give her a nice push, make sure that there is none down there on the bottom. Okay. I'm going to see if I can get a clamp and clamp it together. Right.
probably never going to get this off my finger. We'll just let that rip overnight. Um, and we'll check back in tomorrow and uh, see how she's doing. Let you know if it worked. So we're back the next day. It's uh, about 10.30 in the morning. Um, it's been sitting, I guess, maybe since 4 o'clock yesterday afternoon, maybe 3, 4 o'clock. Um, so it's been setting approximately, that be about 15 hours or so. Um, that's the minimum uh, cure time that it says to leave it. I think it's 15 to, to 24 hours. Um, so it seems to be holding up pretty well. Um, I mean, it doesn't, it's not breaking or anything. Um, I gotta do some sanding on the bottom. I'll just put a piece of sandpaper down on the piece of glass there and just run it over a few times because some of that JB Weld got on the cracks over here. Um, but uh, it seems to have worked. Uh, the real test is just going to be will it plane as well as it did before. But the fix seemed to work, so I'll get it cleaned up and we'll give it a test. <coughs> Woo! Just gonna take some thousand grit sandpaper and uh, put it on this piece of glass here and just run the, the plane over it. Just heard a tink. Um, just run the plane over it, try to knock down the places where the JB Weld kind of leaked out and just clean up the sole a little bit. So I can see already that um Try to zoom in here, see if you guys might be able to see, let me just focus it in closer and see if you can, you can see there that it's a little bit, um, it's kind of higher on the front part than it is on the back. This side seems to be pretty good. You can see another crack in there already. Um, like I said, it was already cracked whenever I got it. But, um, so, not the best plan to begin with, but it's been working well for me, so we'll just keep it going, see if we can get it cleaned up more. It looks pretty good, honestly. Pretty good. Um, so let's uh, let's throw all the good stuff back in and uh, see if she still works. All right, let's give it a test. So we got a little piece of uh, black walnut here that I was working on yesterday, <coughs> and um, let's see if she's gonna work. Pretty good little shaving. Pretty dang good. I'd call that a success. So, <clears throat> as you can see, the plane is fixed. Um, JB Weld together, uh, let it sit. I read it, the math in my head and it's actually about 18 hours. Um, so just let it sit. I don't know if you have to clamp it together. Um, I'm just used to working with wood where you put wood glue in it and clamp it together. 
Um, I think the JB Weld would probably work if you didn't clamp it, you just press it tight together. Um, but JB Weld can fix a broken plane if it breaks. Um, I'll try to do maybe like a follow up video in like a couple months or something and see if it's still together or if it's broken again in that time just from normal use. Um, maybe I won't slam it down again. <laughs> uh, so, just a little recap. All I did was mix up some JB Weld. Um, it was a pretty clean break in there, so it fit back together nice. Um, so, mix up the JB Weld, stick it back together. If you have like a piece of glass or... Um, Maybe even like a piece of MDF or something with some wax paper on top so it doesn't stick. Um, just something nice and flat to try to keep the sole as flat as possible whenever you are uh, putting it back together. Um, and then just let it sit for a long time. You don't want to start messing with it before it's able to cure. Um, and then whenever you get done, just run it over some like 1000 grit, 1200 grit, whatever sandpaper um, just to make sure that if it was a little bit off whenever you put it back together that you can flatten it back out and have a nice flat uh, sole on your plane. Um, other than that, I guess that's about it. Fix seemed to work. So hopefully this uh, can maybe help out somebody that has a broken plane or if you find one uh, for like super cheap or somebody's throwing one out or whatever. If it's a nice clean break and fits back together good, you might be able to save it and um, have a nice tool. So, thanks for coming along on this journey with me. Um, and maybe this helped. Uh, if you got any questions or anything, leave a comment and uh, I'll try to answer. But like I said, this is my first time doing anything like this, but it seemed to work and saved my plane. So, see y'all guys next time.